Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. The Nilgiri class frigates also classified as Pollet 17 Alpha are a series of seven guided missile frigates having a displacement of 6670 tons being built at an overall cost of 45000 crore rupees. Under Pollet 17A program a total of four warships by MDL and three warships by GRSE are under construction. The first six ships of the project has been launched so far by MDL and GRSE between 2019 to 2023. The Project 17A ships have been designed in-house by Indian Navy's Warship Design Bureau, the pioneer organization for all warship design activities. Aligning with the country's resolute commitment to art nirbar a substantial 75 percent of the orders for equipment and system of the project 17 a ships have been ordered on indigenous firms including micro small and medium enterprise vindhya giri the sixth frigate of project 17 a was launched on 17th august 2023 by grse in the presence of the president of india Srimati Draupadi murmur it is going to be the third and the last Project 17A frigate under construction by GRSC. Mahendra Giri, the last Project 17A frigate, is launched on 1st September 2023 at MDL Mumbai. The warship is named after a mountain peak in Eastern Ghats located in the state of Orissa. It is the seventh and the last ship of Project 17A frigates. The delivery of four warships, which is under construction by MDL, will commence from financial year 2025 onwards at the rate of one frigate per year. The three warships, which are under construction by GRSE, are scheduled for delivery from mid of 2025 to mid of 2026. The Project 17 frigates are the follow-on series to the Shavalik class frigates, that is Project 17, and are equipped with more sophisticated capabilities. The Project 17A are the most advanced frigates built by Indian Navy and it's because of two main features. The first one is its modular design and second one is its stealth. The P-17A frigates are the first major warship to be built using the methodology of integrated modular construction a manufacturing process in which multiple modules or blocks of a vessel's hull are pre-assembled or pre-outfitted independently before being aggregated for final assembly. The frigate's design incorporates a significant degree of stealth and low radar observability. By the use of composite materials, radar absorbent coatings and low observable radar transparent technologies. The frigate also maintains a low infrared and low acoustic signature. The Project 17A uses a flush deck layout in which the deck has a uniform continuous layout from bow to stern which reduces its radar cross-section making it stealthier. As a part of its anti-surface warfare capability, the class features one 8-cell BrahMos anti-ship cruise missiles. The vessels are also equipped with one Automillera 76mm naval gun. As a part of its anti-air warfare capabilities, the class feature four 8-cell VLS for 32 Barak 8 extended range surface-to-air missiles with two placed at the bow and two placed at the aft. The Barak 8ER, also classified as LRSAM is an extended range variant of the original Barak 8. The new variant is expected to feature a range of about 150 km. As a part of the anti submarine warfare capabilities, the frigate features two triple torpedo launchers for firing anti submarine torpedoes. The class also features two RBU 6000 anti submarine rocket launchers capable of firing anti submarine projectiles to a depth of up to 1000 meter. It is also equipped with two anti-torpedo decoy system and four decoy launchers which presumably 
may be an STL Maris torpedo countermeasure system and the Kavach anti-missile decoy launchers, respectively. Each ship spans 149 meters in length and 17.8 meters at beam and displaces 6,670 tons. Each frigate features two General Electric LM2500 gas turbines manufactured by G Aviation and two MAN12528 STC four-stroke engines manufactured by MAN Diesel and Turbo in a combined diesel and gas that is CODAG propulsion configuration. The CODAG is a type of propulsion system for warship that needs maximum speed and is considerably faster than their cruise speed, particularly warships like modern frigates or corvettes. The Nilgiri class features ELM 2248MF star AESA radar as its primary radar suite. It also features Indra LTR25 Lanza surface search radar as its secondary radar suite. The frigate is also equipped with an advanced combat management system CMS 17A equipped with sophisticated data links for higher interoperability among the various other warships. The class is equipped with BL Hamsa NG sonar developed by DRDO. The Hamsa NG is a hull mounted active compassive integrated sonar system capable of detecting, localizing, classifying and tracking subsurface targets in both active and passive modes. Just like Vishakhapatnam class destroyer, the Nilgiri class also features the Shakti electronic warfare suite to provide an electronic layer of defense. This was today's update. Please let us know your views on this in comment section. If you like the video, do not forget to like, share and subscribe. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind. We will soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector.